my three-year-old. Wonderful, beautiful little girl. I mean, she is vibrant. She's loud. She's fun. She's energetic. She's alive. She's alert. Let's say they pass this law, mandated vaccines. Let's say that she happens to be one of those children that has an adverse reaction. Let's say that I take her back and within hours she's seizing. And within days, she's not talking to me. And within weeks, she's laying there not moving at all with no communication at all. And I go back and I say, look what you've done to my child. You did this. I had her for three years and she was absolutely fine. You did this to my baby. You forced me to do this. You know what they're going to say? They're going to look at me and say, sorry. Next. Next yeah. in line. Let's go. That's what they're going to say. Most people have these newborns that come out, they don't know personalities, they don't see their development yet, they're just, they're the little babies. So you get all these injections in them, you get them pumped with all these vaccines, and the CDC, the, oh, well, that must have been something else, that wasn't the vaccines. And the parents start questioning that, oh, maybe it wasn't the vaccine, maybe my child was born with these problems. Now, here's the catch. These parents like me that have unvaccinated children and you push vaccines on my kids and I take my four in there and any of mine have a bad reaction, buddy, I'm going to know. I'm going to know 100% it was those vaccines that did it. And talk about a pissed off parent, especially when you mandate me to inject that in my child, my child has a reverse, an adverse reaction and you look at me and say, sorry. Next in line, next in line, and I'm sitting there for the next 40 years, 50 years, taking care of a child that, that can't move anymore, that can't operate like she did for the three years, my son that's five, for five years, and you're not held accountable for this, but yet you're mandating me do this? That's messed up. Even if you are pro-vaccine, you take your child in there, and there's a problem, sorry, next.